Hi, my name's Mr Hyde. I'm the Head of Geography uh, at Exeter School. Uh, geography is no longer a subject of memorising names of flags, capital cities of far-flung countries. The subject today is about understanding the more complex relationships that we as humans have in the natural world, how we live in it, depend on it, and how we are changing it. At Exeter School, we look to equip our pupils with the necessary knowledge and understanding of the human and physical world, as well as the skills and the creative thinking needed to be the big global problem solvers of the future. Our lessons are fun and interesting, with engaging and interactive learning approaches, such as investigating population growth using a jelly baby game, or 3D modelling of landforms using Play-Doh, exploring Japanese culture through art, calligraphy, and homemade bento boxes, or using digital mapping to explore the geography of China. Our Key Stage 3 curriculum sets important foundations. In Year 7, we investigate our local geography, looking at processes in the southwest landscape, such as the Jurassic Coast, urban change taking place in Exeter, and how we go about our daily lives in a sustainable way, increasingly important as highlighted by BBC One's recent extinction documentary. Our study of extreme environments in Year 8 broadens out our studies to a global scale, looking at a range of environments and how humans interact with these. From here, our Year 9 study the hazardous world, learning about hurricanes, earthquakes, volcanoes and mountain hazards. Importantly, we begin to look at how we can manage our human activities alongside the natural world. Our GCSE pupils follow the AQA syllabus, which builds on our spiral curriculum developed at Key Stage 3 with a mixture of human and physical topics. Fieldwork is integrated with the course and pupils carry out two investigations through the course with trips to Dawlish Warren and Bristol. Our A-level pupils follow the Cambridge International course. Often with four sets of 10 to 12 pupils, geography is a popular subject and our pupils see the relevance and importance of their studies, with a good number going on to study geography or related courses at university. We aim to bring in high quality speakers who are experts in their fields throughout the year to extend pupils' learning beyond the confines of the syllabus. This included recent talks on polar exploration, forced migration and environmental degradation. But geography can't truly be understood within the four walls of a classroom. It must be experienced. In all year groups, we like to get out and see the things that we teach about, with local field trips to beer, Axe Valley Wetlands, Dawlish Warren, Lyme Regis, flood relief on the River X, all embedded into our curriculum. We also offer inspiring overseas trips with visits to the Swiss Alps for the lower and middle fifth, and in recent years, sixth form trips to Iceland and Sicily. These seek to enrich the learning that, we, that takes place in the classroom, as well as instill a sense of awe and wonder about our planet. In the words of Sir David Attenborough, the natural world is the greatest source of excitement the greatest source of visual beauty, the greatest source of intellectual interest. It is the greatest source of so much in life that makes life worth living.